Hey, what's up? I'm Zoe, and today I have this binder. This is a very impromptu unboxing setup video or whatever. Um, <laughs> so for Really Bad Boy, I guess part of the official merch that SM put out this time was having a binder. And I have always wanted a group binder. I know that Twice has a lot of binders like this, and I know I've seen like, I think Oh My Girl have a few, and some other select groups have had them. It's not very common, but some groups have it. Um, <laughs> I just, like, oh my gosh, look at this thing. I love the design, I love the hot pink, like, literally, it's perfect. I, I really like that they did this, it's totally different, and, yeah, it's smaller than I thought it was going to be though. I don't know if this is even, is this an inch or is it like half an inch? Let's see. It looks a little smaller. I don't know, I think it might be half an inch. I don't think this is an inch. No, I think it's half an inch. Okay, SM, you could have at least given us an inch, but whatever. <laughs> I don't really think that I will make a habit of buying binders like this if SM keeps doing them for Red Velvet. Also because I really don't think I have enough photo cards for that, but I, I guess we'll see what can fit in here. Um, I do want to use it just because, I mean, I spent the money. It is something that is usable and practical, especially as a collector. When I first saw this, I, <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. I thought it was like fake fan merch or something. Like, I, I just couldn't believe it. <laughs> I was just like, what? And I only saw one listing of it when I first saw it. So it was a little suspect at first <laughs> and I just wasn't sure but it's so cute once i saw a second listing for it i just knew i had to get it unfortunately the first seller that i used for this they didn't actually own any of the binders they just like had it up as a listing to go and buy them so i thought i had it totally taken care of totally out of the way and then i get a message from the seller a few weeks later and they're like hey so it turns out i went to sm today they don't have any more. They don't know when they're going to get any more. I'm sorry. I'll refund you. Like, excuse me? <laughs> what do you mean? Like, I hate when sellers list stuff and they don't actually have the item. Like, what are you saying to me? So I ended up ordering this from Great Music CD. They are on eBay. They are one of the more trustworthy <laughs> sellers and they have been around for years. They have so much merch, so many groups. Um... I would definitely say if you are more of an SM stan, you are into a lot of SM groups in general, definitely check them out as a seller because they usually have a lot of the stuff that is at the little, their little store <laughs> or whatever that is. Inside the binder, you get two photo cards. And that was like my big motivation in this because I was like, okay, I, I need, like give it to me. Two photo cards, one of them is a group card and then you get a selected member. Of course I got Sulgi because that's my girl. You already know if you watch my videos coming in who I got. <laughs> so you get one, two, five, nine pocket sleeves. They are generic, but they're SM. I don't know if these are like UV or whatever, but they're very, um, let me see if I can actually show you because, oh, I thought, I thought there was going to be a thing on here. There's nothing on there. Okay. Um, oh gosh. Can I even get my big fingers in here? Did something break? Oh my God. Something broke off. What is that? Oh, I don't think that's anything important. Okay. <laughs> we're good. We're good. Like, I don't know if you can even tell. It looks kind of stuck together kind of here. Like, I don't know if you can kind of see that in the light. But it looks a little weird, you know, like the cards are just stuck to the... <laughs> so I don't really know if I would actually use these for my cards. Like, I mean, this card doesn't look like it's damaged in any way. And I usually put a little poly sleeve on top of my cards before I put them actually into the sleeves. But I don't know if these are like, <laughs> like what kind of sleeves these are. So first we have our group card, which looks like this. You get all five girls on there, obviously. And it looks 
really good. I really love the styling from Really Bad Boy. I cannot rave about it enough. Like seriously, it's so good. This is a really good group card. And then the back just looks like that. The solo shot. And then the back. They aren't as thick as album photo cards. I will say they're very thin. I think two of these put together is usually how thick a photo card is, but like solo, they're just not that. Yeah, they're not that thick. When, <laughs> I'm just gonna leave this here, but when I do my photo cards, I always put them in little poly sleeves. So I'm going to do that now. With the Ultra Pro sleeves that I use, these tend to be too big to be in the sleeve unless the photo card is big enough to like fit this whole thing you know um unless it's that big it usually will bubble up and I don't really like that <laughs> um it looks very bad and it just puffs up the sleeve I don't like it so I like to cut off a big bit of the side of it and then I always put my photo card in here so that like there's like this open corner, as you see. See how it's open? And then I put my card in there. So then once I put it in my sleeve, the top is covered and the side. It's just this side that's open. That's what I've learned to do. The things you learn as you continue to collect. <laughs> I feel like everyone finds something that works out for them. There are some people who do more steps than that. This is my red velvet binder. As you can see, my babies are on the front. And yes, okay. So I really need to redo these sleeves. Like it's really just not even, <laughs> it is not, <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so obviously only the photo cards can probably fit in there. So we're just gonna take these out. That actually wasn't so bad. This literally perfectly fits the sleeves that I have, but I would imagine if there is someone who actually collects every single member for every single era, this binder would get filled very, very quickly because this, I like, I don't feel like I can probably fit too many more sleeves in here. Take the mail things out. I do this. I don't know if I've ever showed this, but yeah, I do this for my mail stuff whenever I have something in the mail. I think it's cute. <laughs> it makes me very excited. <laughs> All right, so. Okay, normally I would put the group card in the middle, but I rather like having the hollow cards in the middle, so that will go there. Group card will go here. Like so. Okay, I think that looks good this is actually a rather tall binder too it has like a lot of give room for the sleeves like there's a lot of room at the top a lot of room at the bottom it's a nice little binder so I like it red velvet once again showing you everything now we're gonna do a flip through and then I'll end this video so you can go because I know it's probably not that interesting I just thought some people might want to see it so yeah these are just my silky and joy cards I'm really happy that I was able to get this binder, especially after the whole fiasco where I ordered it and then a few weeks later, that whole thing. <laughs> but I'm happy that I was able to get it in the end. Great music really pulled through. 
I'm still recovering from going to see Red Velvet at the Red Mayor concert. It was so, so amazing. If you haven't watched my vlog for that, you definitely should go and watch it. I will link it somewhere. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Comment if you have anything to say. Subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on alerts if you want to. And that is everything. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!